Yo, what's up guys? I am back from my holiday. I do not know if you guys can see my tan. I forgot to turn my own over and tan here, but it's fine. My legs are all tanned. I had an amazing holiday. I had all plans of filming a video out there for you guys out in Sulu, but I had actually forgot. I was having a lot of fun, so I forgot, so I didn't film. So I'm going to show you... Um, the makeup look that I did and some of the th things like I wore. Um, I didn't actually take any photos of my makeup because when we went it was just like done and then entertainment at night. That sort of stuff. So before I go on, I got this little Harry Potter bag reduced to £2 from Primark. And in it it's got my brushes, makeup, that sort of thing. We didn't wear like a lot. Oh god, there was a lid off something. Um, I brought a lot of stuff back because we went into Barcelona and I went into Sephora and I went a bit over the top. So. I didn't take moisturiser, I was using this because this hydrates my skin, so I don't know if it's been burst a little, I do not know. It doesn't come out and I cannot use it. Guys, I'm trying to get it out. Alright, there we go. No idea what happened there. That was one of the things I used. Um, so again, I've got a tan on my face. So this pro my foundation probably isn't the right colour right now. Um, yes, I know this is a strobe cream, but that's. This is the best thing I have ever used. I don't know if you guys can see I have I've had my eyebrows done. So what did I take? Oh yeah, I took this brush for a foundation. It's a bit yucky yuck. As you guys can see, it's nowhere near my colour of my tan. So please excuse that mess so you guys will probably see how bad it is um two seconds i took my mirror and i took my urban to keep palette as well and my chocolate bar palette by too faced i don't know if you can see i've got a big spot coming out here this is just great. I can make this work if I put it like down my neck and stuff. Um, but what all I'd say is, do not wear makeup coming home. I didn't. Because I don't really wear makeup when I travel home anyway. But I just wouldn't chance it, girls. Like, it's all good if you have like your a tan colour with you or you go to Sephora and buy a colour of what you'd have when you were tanned. Um, yeah that was all good. I had intentions of buying a tan colour from Sephora until I got in I had actually forgot. That's how bad my memory is. I got my eyebrows tinted as well before I went on Saturday. And I'm so glad I did it. I am still like super tired and everything. Like still adjusting to being back home and all that stuff. Um, I did have a beauty blender. What is that? Oh, I 
is still a big bag. Um, just to make sure everything is like blinded. Before I went, I had no tan whatsoever. Obviously, this but there's a different heat over there, so my face doesn't really tan here. But oh my god, it tanned on my face, tanned to like this area, my arms, my legs. My legs only do not tan whatsoever. And oh my god, they had tanned so well in that two days of being there. Two days. Um, so that was like really good. But I've got really sore bits here with flying. No matter where I fly, I always end up with sore bits like bones here oh and a primer I would have used would have been professional which it was but my two concealers my two, my two concealers I don't really do much, did much to my brows I don't really literally um Added a little bit of this one where I would highlight, and the other one goes where I have spots. A lot of my spots cleared, they right, they were away by the time I flew out, and I put spot cream on before I went because no matter when I fly, oh my spots reappear so I thought right I'm not chancing it and I covered them and what happened they all reappeared halfway through my flight I didn't put enough on and I was really gutted because I spent my whole holiday with spots even though the sea water was helping them, I can't stay in the sea long because I hate the sea. Um, I'm not really a big fan of the sea, going to like, and that for obvious reasons. Um, please excuse my hair. Um, I'm not really one for going to the sea um, and stuff like that. Um, just just stuff has happened in the past sort of family and stuff. Um. Just because I, I lost my brother and things, so for my brows, I didn't. I don't think I actually took a brow brush. I'm sure, yeah, I did. Um, and I just took this little bit of middle powder and literally tapped off the excess. Just sort of filled in a little bit of this where it isn't so fine on that one, and that's all I did. Then put a little bit of primer on for my eyes. Look at that! <laughs> Compared to me, 10. And I use this ball end of my beauty blender. Really gently on my eyes. No matter with traveling, my eyes are so get so sore the day after as well. So I get quite a lot of things like sore areas after flying, and that, which is why. And I, no matter where I fly, I always get quite like jet lag, like leg after it. For some reason, um, 
then I would just bronze a little. Um, so I'll get a well saying you can bronze up your foundation. I wouldn't use that much bronzer. I look very silly because I'm tanned. But I'm just sort of showing you guys what I did. I never really did much. It took me a lot quicker over there. And I'm just sort of taking my time on this. Just really talk to you guys as well. Um, if you want to go and check out my Facebook, you'll see the photos. I never took photos of me wearing makeup because, well, I was just at night and we weren't really doing anything. Um, it was all just sort of down watching the entertainment or chilling in the apartment. So, I wasn't like doing anything exciting. So I didn't really take photos of it yet, but I would, next time I go to Salute I will not be taking makeup, I would rather just um, leave it at home because I only wore it once. Um, which was when we went to out at night and I think not to Barcelona. It was only the once. And I just went very patchy quickly because of the heat at night. And when you're sweating in the heat during the day, like from five ish, you're still very hot over in Salou. So you're not really wanting to wear makeup. Um, why wasn't it anyway? I only put it on that one night because I felt like very self conscious of my skin and due to the fact of. I came, I was very spotty, um, I put on a good few layers of concealer before I even left the house and I took it with me to top it up. I was just so insecure of my spots that day, I mean they had swollen out all down my, like my chin, it was all swollen out and everything so I didn't really take photos that day either and um, I was just very like my lower face all around here and at this time it almost was like small like really badly swollen so I didn't really take I didn't take photos anyway I probably took like a few and just saved them but didn't post them and I don't know why I took this because I didn't actually use it, I just used it for I really just used champagne truffle all the time. For that one time and I just used that brush and packed it on it. Just to make it a shimmer look. I just took it under a little. I wouldn't recommend wearing mascara, guys. It just literally, when it was quite hot during the day, you sort of sweat it off. But I did wear mascara and I wore it in my roller life. It wasn't even like proper coated. It was just a quick couple of blinks. That's not a joke. 
And then I just put a bit of lippy on, which was this one. You know, I just didn't. I didn't want to draw too much attention to this bit of my face due to the fact of it. Um, I just wouldn't rec I me recommend taking a setting powder to set in your concealer if you want to wear it on a hot day to, uh, across there because you really have to set your foundation and everything otherwise it just moves and but that's all I did. I mainly wore like highlighter so the tension was up here and not down at, at my swollen face that night. I would have just dotted like a load of concealer on and went out but I couldn't because it looked horrible and I've got pendant needles in my toes. I don't know if you guys can see how tanned ah, my feet and my legs are but they are. Um, and I just want to apologise for not filming while I was out there but next holiday I go on I definitely will be. Right guys, I'm signing off and I'll see you guys in the next video. Love you guys and thank you so much for your love and your support and I'll see you guys real soon.